Good morning guys and welcome to Sam the Machinist channel. Today's video I am going to show you easiest way how are you going to make your radios, your chamfer on your part. No need to use G02 or G03, just use G1 and no need to find the, the start point and the end point of each radius or chamfer. This this programming guys is very easy, absolutely easy and you are going to love it. And I believe this um, kind of programming is only 50% of the machinist knows about this one. And guys, this is your time to, to know this one. And I encourage you, please watch the video up to the end of my vlog so that you are not you are going to learn this kind of programming ain't nobody my drawing guys I have 5 mm chamfer 20 mm radius 10 mm radius 10 mm chamfer by 45 also another 35 mm radius and another 15 mm radius total length of my block is 200 mm and 100 millimeter and I have now guys my program for my positioning and I'm going to use 16 mm end mill and I'm going to position my end mill X minus 10 Y0 which is the one I have and let's assume the thickness of my part is 30 millimeter G1, G90 because I am going to use G90 Z minus 30 F 1000 so once my Z is down and also guys I put numbers on each move on my drawing so that it's easy for us to understand this programming for for those who are not yet know how to use this advanced programming of chamfering and radius number one go to g1 g41 x0 and then g1 y100 r20 so let's write this one and the machine G1, G41, so I'm going to use cutter compensation, X0, this is the first move, G1, G41, X0, and the next move is going to Y100, this is my datum, Y100, and this is guys the very important one that you should not forget, shift and then comma as you can see comma and the size of our radius r for radius 20 point then end of block insert so i have now y100 r20 so automatically the machine are going to do this radius no need to use G02 or G03 and my next command is X since this one is 100 coming from the datum so X 100 shift comma C for chamfer C10 because the, the size of my chamfer is 10 mil and my next command is going to this point the value of my y y50 y50 
Ship, comma, R for Regius, 10, and a block. So guys, Y50, comma, R10. And my next move is going to this point. X165 and a block input. So I should put number on it so that you're not going to get confused. Alright, so that's the fifth command that I'm going to do. And the number six, guys, is going to do the 35 radius and 15 radius. On the next command, guys, I am going to use G02 instead of G1. G02 X200 Y0. Y0 because our datum is on this point. So Y0 R. 35 and for the next for the because these two radius guys are next to each other there is no straight line that's why we are going to put them on this, the same block and shift comma r15 kind of block so g02x 200 Y0 R35 which is the radius and comma R15 it is okay guys if, even if you are putting two radius at the same line and the next and the next command guys is going to X0 since this one is G02 to cancel G02 I will put G1, X, 0, and the chamfer is 5 mil, C, oops, ship, comma, C5, which is 5 mil chamfer. So now I will go to this point, and I need another line, Y6. I can put Y5 if I want. Is it okay to put Y5 but I want to make it 1 mil over so that's why I make it 6 mil so my cutter now is going to this point above the 5 mil chomper and I'm going to cancel my cutter compensation G1 G40 X minus 10 it is necessary guys that you are going to cancel your cutter compensation with G40 or else you are going to have an alarm and I will select my fix form to end my tool insert and just change this one to M30 and I will just also put this number so that you can follow this one easily for those who don't know how to use this kind of programming especially using this comma and I'm going to run this one guys in simulation so that we are going to see if this one is going to work let's check this one guys in simulation so let's run in single block see that's the radius Alright guys, that's exactly the shape that we we want. Make a shout out to my friend Titan of CNC and to my Aloysians family. Shout out to all of you guys and to my brother Kanolinga and to all Saint Ansel, my number one supporter, Donabel. To all my subscribers guys, thank you so much for always watching our videos. And also guys, please comment down below what what do you think about this tutorial if you like it please if you like the video please leave your comment down below what do you think on this tutorial video and see you next time on my next vlog